All right, what's going on guys? Manbot321 here today, bringing back another Diamondcraft SMP. As you can tell by the thumbnail and the, uh, the, the title and whatnot, this is going to be the finale. Um, a lot has happened and I just wanted to talk about it. I will be doing a separate video on why I'm leaving the Diamondcraft SMP and all of that, but today I just wanna do a finale world tour, uh, wrap it up uh, properly, and then we can talk about it in another video, why I'm leaving and what's happening. So yeah, I think it's only appropriate we started off where we started it all off. And I just want to show you guys some of the progress I've done. And wow, I really want to put together a compilation video of Diamondcraft and everything I've done because even though I am leaving and things are happening, um, it doesn't take away from the great experience I've had here and all the great people I've met. I've been playing on this server for so long now. Um, things It's incredible. I can't even put into words all of this, this, everything that's happened. And I don't want to take away from that by one uh, at all. So yeah, let's just jump right into my house. If you haven't seen this before, this is my house. Got a little beacon in the background. You guys probably have not seen that. And look at this, 51 diamond blocks. That's not even healthy. Um, I'm just going to be leaving these here, tossing them around my base. People can come pick them up. I'm, Like I said, I'm, I'm leaving. I don't know how many others will be staying, but I'm sure that there will be some. So I'm just going to be leaving these around. We can scatter these around different places. People are more than welcome to take them. This is my house, the inside. This took quite a while, um, something I really worked hard on. And it doesn't look like I have my food in here. Anyone can come take this. If you're watching my video, free, feel free. Please come take any of this stuff. This stuff is free. I'm not going to be using it and whatnot. So yeah, let's actually sleep one last time on the server. I think it's only proper. I got a golden apple. A few of the things I do have are from Xander, who actually left also, in case you guys did not know that. Um, he left too. So yeah, um, let's head down to this side first and take a quick look at what we got down here. So this is my furnace room that I started quite a while ago. Started off with this, then I added in the automatic furnace, automatic furnace, sorry. Um, all of this good stuff, pretty cool. Head into my chest room. This is probably one of the things I'm most proud of. Um, once again, all this stuff, feel free to please come take it. I'm not going to be using it. Uh, let's grab some food I left in here. Awesome. Um, I'll be eating that gold god apple. I have no use for it, so I might as well eat it eventually. But as you head on to here, we got my beacon that I set up pretty recently, gives me some speed, which is awesome. Got some potion room. Uh, this was a pretty cool room. I'm really proud of this design. Uh, this was something I really wish that I put more time and effort into. And uh, hey, heck, I'll take some speed. And I might as well take a jump boost. Yeah, I might as well. I don't know what's stopping me. I'm not going to be using them. Um, yeah, so that's my potion room. Really cool. I never got to build building something behind this painting. However, I did build something behind this one. I love this room. It's kind of a little mass storage room that I used to store items I had too many of and couldn't fit in my chest room anymore. So let's toss this potion of swiftness in. Grab ourselves a jump potion. Heck, why not? Woo! That's pretty cool. All right. Uh, yeah, so that's this wing of the house. I'll be heading outside now and then we can see the other wing. I never got to building things upstairs, something I really am sad about. Uh, the upstairs is vacant. I really wanted to do some cool lava tower and whatnot. But I unfortunately did not get to it. Wow, we got some jump boost. It's pretty cool. So that's my house. Build my pixel art face, as you can see right there. My face. Uh, yeah, I'm pretty proud of that. This was the cool map. I'm be show I'm actually gonna do a video on this, on how to make this in Minecraft. Uh, it's pretty simple. I don't know how many of you know it, but it's pretty cool. So I'll be doing a video on that. Got all of our farms. We got cows, pigs, chicken. Um, uh, what are those called? Rabbits. You name it. We have sheep. And then up here, same thing. It gets a little bit laggy over here because I did a lot of redstone, but we had all of the different types of farms. You name it, we had it once again. Wow, we can jump high. Cool. Um, this is my automatic fishing farm, something I used actively. Really cool. I really enjoyed that. Uh, this is my automatic uh, pumpkin and melon farm, something that really was helpful to get emeralds and trade for books. Sugarcane farm I actually built pretty recently. Automatic Cactus Farm, you guys have been seeing this since day one. This is one of the first projects I actually did on the SMP and something I'm really proud of. So yeah, um, let's head over here now um, before we head over to see the rest of the automatic stuff. This is a PVP arena I built, never quite got to it. Over there we got Justin's base, quite a cool base. Um, yeah, he's still remaining on SMP. So like I said, still go check out the description. Watch all these guys because they're great people, all of them. We got some villagers in here to trade with. The mending one, the farmer, all were great. Um, really help my shop grow and everything like that. So let's just toss an enderpearl over here. 
um, over here we got the disc farm which I actually did a video on uh, you guys should be seeing that shortly I'm not sure when this video will be coming out uh, this is a stone generator a, a nano farm cow farm cobblestone generator automatic potion automatic flower cobblestone generator automatic chicken we had it we had it all that's what I loved is I put in the work and it paid off and I really loved it my villager farm I never really that was built pretty recently I never really got to do all of it but yeah so there's that this is all of my outside you name it we had all the farms something really cool that I'm really proud of down here is a mining shaft um, there was something really cool I wish that I had mined more in I stopped mining as soon as I um, got all of my stuff for um, for my shop all my diamonds all like that I just didn't have a use for it anymore up there's an ice farm I no really no really reason to show you guys that um, something I'm pretty proud of another thing I won't be showing you guys I did a video on it though you can go check it out in the playlist um, I built a long uh, thing to the end never got to fight the ender dragon I really hope the guys and girls on here that remain um, go ahead and fight that so yeah let's head over to this last wing we still got our speed perfect um, yeah this is a, this was a small wing nothing much enchanting room got an ender chest and anvil pretty cool it's one of my first builds and this is something I'm really proud of this took a long way this is a railway all the way to spawn something I think that looks really nice I went with the redstone lantern design along with a few other blocks and I think it turned out pretty cool I'm really proud of it um, I used it a lot people used it a lot then people were always complimenting on how they thought it looked so good and so that I'm really proud of this in Prince's game. He helped me build it, which was awesome. Then we did that rail pixel art above it. To head to spawn, let's start on this side. This is Prince's Gaming's wool shop. This is a path that leads up to the, uh, I believe it is a nether portal. Yeah, this is EKT's redstone shop. Looks really great. Never really got around to visiting it. Looks like he's selling a few of the same things as I did. Um, yeah, really nice shop. Really proud of everything that got done on here. And like, once again, even though I am leaving, it doesn't take away anything, the great experiences I had, you know? Like, look at this. This is one of the most incredible builds I've ever seen, you know? Um, cop up there. Uh, the bank, that was pretty cool. I think they're planning on using that for the Iron Titan to store stuff. Uh, Princess's new shop, obviously my shop. I'm sure we sold everything out. Yeah, I'm not even going to bother looking. Um, everything here is free now. If you're watching, take what you like. Uh, or someone else is free to run the shop. I won't be continuing it. Xander's food looks really nice. An email system that I never quite got to. It's a really cool idea where you could send messages to others. Um, I really like that idea. Once again, Ashley's shop over there. This is our awesome looking spawn. Uh, this this is incredible. Um, this is something that really looks nice. That I'm really proud of the people that built it. And yeah, so let's head over to this part. Over here we got my shop. Um, looks like we're doing okay, but yeah, this is my shop that I built pretty recently. You guys just saw that probably last episode, actually. This heads up to the, um, Iron Titan, where I'll probably be finishing the episode off because it has a great view of spawn. And here we got a shop that's being worked on by Ms. Dre, and it looks cool. I really like what she's done. Uh, wrapping up around here, got a few more shops. EKT's base is over there. You can go check out his perspective. Let's go ahead and pop the God Apple. Because, I mean, heck, why not? Hey, we got an achievement. Overpowered. Sweet. Uh, this is EKT's Pork Shop. Really cool looking shop by Justin. I, I was always checking this to buy stuff. It looks great. I love what he did here. Uh, I think Xander built it, if I'm correct. And it looks great. Wow, we have a lot of hearts. Absorption 4. Pretty cool. This was a courthouse, I believe, that never quite got finished. Looking great. Uh, gym shop in here. Uh, yeah, gym shop, uh, enchant, kind of just random things. This was uh, panda slack shop, I think. I'm not 100% sure on that. This is my junk shop that I opened here uh, to go ahead and you can dump off anything you want. Come pick it up for free. It looks like someone's cleared out some of it, which is nice. This is Ms. Dre's uh, Lost and Found, which is a really cool idea. Really like what she did with that. And I think that actually concludes up spawn. I think we'll go ahead and finish up at the town hall because uh, this is a pretty iconic building. You guys will probably be seeing this around a few of the other members, and it looks so good. I, Xander built it with the help. I don't think anyone else helped at the time because he was solo, but it looks so good. The floating water, the glowstone, everything. Everything about it looks so incredible. I'll actually take a quick stop in the nether hub so you guys can see, because in here it looks so great. 
Go ahead and toss on some more speed. Yeah, he did an incredible job. I'm really proud of what he did in here. Looks, it just looks great. You know, if you ever want to see more, I've done a few things. And if I were you, I would suggest go back and watch some of my old videos. I did a lot of videos um, touring around, showing things because the hard thing about SMPs is you just never know what you're going to be getting. But here it was incredible. I can't explain the experience I have. And look how good our Nether Hub looks. If you're ever looking for a design for Nether Hub, look no further. This is incredible. Um, I think this was built by a few members. I can't remember exactly who. I think Xander, Princess, Mizdre, a few others. And man, it looks great. Dixie too. So yeah, this this looks awesome. I'm really proud of what they did in here. Um, yeah, I really love that. So let's head back here. And I think that's gonna wrap it up. Uh, it's tough to leave. I'm not I'm not gonna say it's not tough to leave. Um, it's just something's happened. Uh, new opportunities arise. I think that I will be join. I no question. I will be joining another SMP um, at some point. So you guys can look out for that. I don't want you guys to think, oh, he's quitting SMPs, you know, because that's a staple of my channel is Let's Plays and tutorials, and I wouldn't be where I am without that, so. That's not going to land. That's going to land. Can I not go up? That was weird. Okay, um, yeah, without this, I don't know where I'd be. So, this Diamond Craft SMP has helped my channel grow so much. It's really quite incredible what it has done. And I just want to thank, again, all the people that... Oh, go. That was close. Ah, uh, go. So let me finish it up here. But like I was saying, I just want to thank all the people that helped me. Helped me get to the point where I am on my channel. We just hit 400 subscribers, which is awesome. Something I never thought I would even hit. And this SMP has helped a huge ton. But with my channel growing, new opportunities arising, I really want to look for new opportunities and uh, move on from the old and find new. And so I will be looking for another SMP. If you have any suggestions comment down below i'm looking at a few currently i'll keep that kind of on the down low until i discover the one i'm going to start again on uh, but yes as i said once again this is the finale there will be no more diamond crafts uh episode 22 finale pretty cool um in the episode that i talk about why i'm leaving i will show like all my stats and everything like that because it's pretty cool i put a lot of time in it anyone that says i haven't is kidding themselves because I put in a lot more time than I probably even should have. So yeah, I just think I wanted to show you guys this because this is something else. I love this view. Uh, they can remove my tiny blocks. It's not going to hurt anyone. Oh, look at that. It doesn't get better than that, does it? Look how it's just crazy cool to see how much spawn has changed. Everything that's happened. Cool farming over there. Just It looks so awesome. And I figured the only appropriate way would be finish off this episode is from up above it above it all above it all and just thank you guys so much for everything that's happened on this server um i just want to thank you guys for being supportive watching all my episodes all my episodes average about 100 views which is something incredible i never thought i'd be able to achieve and so yeah on to new things on to new smp this is the finale once again so thank you guys so much for watching and yeah that's gonna wrap it up for an episode today um i hope you guys did enjoy i'll catch you guys later this is Manbot, and I'm out.